He's taking his time. You're free to go. Hi. Go as quick as I could. It's probably a wasted journey, Doctor. I feel fine. Oh, not at all. Your friend's here said you had an angina attack. She broke up my marriage and slept with my husband. She's not my friend. Don't let her fob you off. Hey, shall I put the kettle on? It's the least I can do after dragging you all the way out here. Oh, don't you worry about that. You just sit there and let me take a look at you. After that, I'll brew up. How's that sound? <laughs> I feel ever so guilty taking your time up like this. Oh, you're OK. That's the main thing. Just remember, if it ever happens again and you're unable to use your spray, please call an ambulance. Now, I'll write a prescription for an additional one so you don't run low. Just pop into the surgery when you can. Thanks. Oh, the hours you doctors put in. Oh, there's some biscuits in the tin over there. Oh, go on, you're twisting me on. <laughs> I try not to have them myself, but then I can't be trying that hard, otherwise I wouldn't keep on buying them, and there's only me and my daughter. <laughs> Is that your uh, daughter in the photo? Yeah, that's Belle. And uh, she still lives at home, you say? Oh, she thinks she's old enough to live on her own, but she's only 17. Mind you, I expect I was like that at her age. Have you got any kids, Dr Bailey? No. No, I don't. Well, you've plenty of time. Enjoy the peace and quiet while you can. You OK? Sorry, um, I've got to go. Oh, is everything all right? Oh, I'm fine. <laughs> Thanks for the tea. Mum, Johnny told me what happened. I came back as soon as I could. I'm fine, love. I'm just fine. No, you don't look it. No, it's a lot of fuss about nothing. <sighs> Listen, I'm sorry about earlier, and I promise I'm going to look after you now. I don't want to argue with you, Belle. No, neither do I. Where are you off? Toilet. Now, don't worry. Oh, OK. Hey, um, I don't think I'm going to be able to make this weekend one of my housemates in a bit of a crisis, so... Yeah, just give me a call back when you get this. I miss you. I was planning to go away for the weekend with a few of my old mates from school. You never mentioned. Oh, yeah, it was pretty last minute, but I've cancelled and I've decided I'm going to stay here with you. If that's what you want, but I've told you I don't need looking after. Yeah, well, Dad always said you're a lousy patient. If you don't believe me, ask Dr Bailey. What? <laughs> he came round earlier, lovely young chap, but I think I must have taken a bit too much of his time because one minute he was enjoying a cuppa and the next he was flying out the door. <laughs> <laughs> oh... <laughs> 